The next step here is to put some plumbing in these boxes so I can get it all set up for automatic watering. Hey, welcome back everybody. I'm out here in the garden again today working on this grow box project that we've had going on for quite a while now. But before I get started on that this afternoon, I have another project that's kind of pressing here on the homestead. And that is right behind me, back there, is my chicken coop. And I've got a bunch of old chickens in there. And tomorrow, over at my brother's place, we're gonna be harvesting some meat birds. We got a big batch of meat birds down there that we're gonna be uh, harvesting tomorrow. And I wanna take some of my old layers so we can dispatch them and cull our herd and and uh, get some of the old hens out that aren't laying anymore. So I'm gonna go take care of that and then I'll get on with some plumbing here. So now I'm ready to get started on this this uh, project here with plumbing my grow boxes so that we can put in some automatic watering. I got a few items that uh, I ordered or bought from Home Depot or wherever. I got one of these guys. This will be my controller, my control unit. I'll hook this onto the, the faucet. I Oh, look at this. <laughs> I got uh, a bunch of this stuff from Drip Depot and uh, they sent a little package here with some suckers in it and then i got a whole bunch of parts here uh, this looks like tees elbows all manner of connectors i got uh, end caps and stuff so a big bag of, of that kind of parts here i got a bunch of on off valves i'm going to do drip tape and i want each drip tape to be able to be turned on and off as I need it. So I've got a bunch of valves here. In the bottom is a roll of drip tape. So I'm gonna set up my system this year with my grow boxes using drip tape. And that's what this is. I got a backflow preventer, a pressure regulator, and this adapter swivel. We'll put it on there. This, this will go on this side. And then my main line will connect into there. So anyway, that's what I got to start with. And then on top of it, I mentioned the main line. I got this big old roll here. So this is what we'll use to uh, connect all the boxes. And then we'll use the drip tape in the boxes. So that's what we got. We're going to get started. All right, everybody, we have got to a good place here with plumbing up these boxes. I have six boxes fully plumbed with the exception of drip tape. Um, so now I think we're gonna move on to filling these boxes. And we have, a, we have a bit of a plan for how we're gonna do that. Some ideas we're gonna throw in there, so to speak. <laughs> but uh, that'll be for another day. 
and we're going to get our mess cleaned up here and move on to other things. We'll see you on the next one. Don't forget to subscribe for more growing, creating, and sipping videos. If you enjoyed this video, you might also like this video here.